Doug always said it doesn't rain on his parade. The weather stayed beautiful at this year's Heritage Festival, where Don Landers and Susan Lieber presented longtime resident attorney Doug Rowe with this year's Heritage Hero Award. We are proud to honor Douglas J. Rowe, 2014 Heritage Hero. Thank you. The Marlboro Main Street Mile had a great turnout this year, with Marlboro's own Austin Turner taking home the title of Fastest Male, and Emily Catterin for Fastest Female. The race was one of many events at the festival that families could participate in together. It was great. Then they left me and went ahead, but that's still perfect. I'm just proud of everybody, and you know, it's, it's exciting to just be able to part and participate in family events, which is very important to us. Businesses and organizations also came together on Main Street to support the community. For the hair, this is the fifth year that we've been here, and it's just wonderful to have our community be in support of each other with all the different organizations. It's nice to see all the familiar faces from our community, both the leaders as well as all of the community service organizations that are around, and the schools and everything else. It's, it's, a, fun, it's a fun day, and it's beautiful weather today, so it makes it even extra special. We have this thing called Fall Product, and what we're doing is we're selling nuts, candies, magazines, and along with helping the troop, it also helps the community because someone could donate he, like money and it could go towards a can of nuts. And what that can of nuts does is it goes into the food pantry and it could go to the families. For the 19th year in a row, the Heritage Festival has brought together the community to celebrate the ethnic diversity here in Marlboro. Well, the Heritage Festival, in my opinion, is a very, very important event because what it does is it celebrates all of the different cultures and the, and the different, different ethnicities. And I think it's so nice to see the exhibits and people sharing in those differences and celebrating them. To us, to have this kind of blending of, of cultures and stuff, it's very American. I mean, that's kind of what we are. We're a melting pot. We kind of, you know, we, we think that, that art and dance and music and things like that are, are universal. There is no agendas. There's no, there's no of the typical politics and, and world nonsense that goes on. It's very pure. It's very honest. It's very open. It's very um, beautiful. I think it's very good uh, to show, like, different culture from different countries and brings, of course, a business. And I think it's, it's very nice. It should be done like at least twice a year, I think. <laughs> this year's festival really brought together the community for great food and entertainment. For Marvel This Week, I'm Brittany Murphy.